right, so today we are going to discuss door handing. So um, I guess the reason why you would need to know the handing of a door would be if you're ordering uh, certain locks or certain door hardware, you actually have to get it handed for that, uh, for that particular handing of the door. So for instance, simplex locks, uh, I think it's L1000, uh, mechanical combination lock. Those are handed, so you have to either order it in left hand or right hand. Um, and there's many other examples of that too. So I figured we'd make a video. We'll make a very simple explanation that anybody can take it and take that information and move on. So there's not a whole lot to cover on this subject. So I'll just kind of show you the example. So the easiest way to determine door handing is get on the outside of the door. And on the outside of the door, whatever the side of the hinges are on. Okay, well I know the hinges are on this side because the lever's on this side, so it's gonna open that way. So I'm on the outside of the door, the hinges are on the left, it is a left hand door, okay? If the hinges were on the right and the lever was over here, it would be a right hand door. Right hand, using my right hand, assuming that you're a right handed person, most people are right handed, so that's what they go off of. So if the hinges were on this side here, it would be a left hand door. And the reason being is, I use my left hand to get in this door. I'm not gonna come across my body and use the right to get in it. So if the lever was on this side of the door, then I would use my right hand to open it. And the hinges are on the, would be on the right. So simple rule, outside of the door, hinges are on the left, left-handed door. Hinges are on the right, right-handed door. Now there is another little variable that uh, there's, what if the door hinges are on the left-hand side, but the door opens toward me? That would be a, it's still a left hand because it's on the left-hand side. If you're on the outside of the door, the hinges are on the left, it's gonna be a left hand, but reverse. So it's just called a left hand reverse. Um, there's not a whole lot of instances where you really, where you need to know that it's also a reverse. Most of the time you just need a left or right, but sometimes you will need to know that information depending on what you're, you're trying to use. So if the door, if the hinges are on the left and you're on the outside of the door, it is a left hand door. This one is a regular true left handed door because it swings in. But if it was to swing toward me, then uh, like for instance, this door right here, the hinges are on the left. If this door was to come out towards me, it is a left hand reverse because it comes toward me. That's it. So it's just left hand, right hand, left hand reverse, right hand reverse. Pretty simple. So uh, there's charts all on the internet about this. So if you have any questions about it, you can pull up a little chart. What I did back when I first started, I go online, looked up door handing, saw a little card that was there, printed it out, cut it out, folded it up, put it in my wallet. That way I had it for me. So you can do that. There's plenty of these examples of those little cards online. They're everywhere. So outside of the door, hinges are on the left, left hand door. Hinges on the right, right hand door. Door swings outward. It's whatever the handing is, reverse. So it's called, you know, left hand reverse, right hand reverse. So real quick, easy video. Just want to put that information out there. Nobody's mentioned that. No one's talked about it. So I figured I'd share that information for everybody. Uh, most locksmiths are going to know this, but some of them that are new to the trade might not. So, uh, or some people might just have a hard time memorizing it. So I just say outside of the door, hinges on what side, and that's your handy. Simple as that. Thank you for tuning in again uh, for the short video, but we appreciate you anyway. Uh, please follow us on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, LinkedIn. We're on all the social media platforms. Also fee feel free to check out our other channel, Udropreneur. It's U-D-R-O-P-R-E-N-E-U-R. Um, it's a little bit behind the scenes, more uh, personal, not so business-like, but uh, we are very new on that channel. I think our third video is coming out this week for there. So it's very new. Uh, we appreciate the support and please uh, join us on the other channels.